Welcome to another episode of rawradianthealth.com and I'm Natasha St. Michael and thank you so much for joining me. So it's Wednesday and today I'm going to show you guys how to do oil pulling. Oil pulling so you can have beautiful white teeth, you can have less problems with your gums, your teeth and even it can help your digestive tract as well. Oil pulling, I think a lot of you are probably wondering what on earth is oil pulling? <laughs> oil pulling is an ancient Indian Ayurvedic technique. It's It's been used for hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of years for detoxification and as well as to maintain good oral hygiene and it has also been known to actually help other problems in the body especially any kind of gastro stomach issues things like that because as we know our mouth is connected to the rest of our digestive system and with the swishing effect of what you're going to be doing with your mouth it it sort of um, awakens your gastric juices and the enzymes and everything to start working okay so pretty much what it what this involves is just taking a little bit of oil cold pressed oil either coconut oil that's virgin organic cold pressed or sesame oil which is also cold pressed organic and not the toasted sesame oil but just plain old sesame oil those are the two oils that you can choose from of using and pretty much all you do is you take like just I'd say a little bit less than a teaspoon and you put it in your mouth and you swish it around for 20 minutes you spit it out and then you rinse your mouth out with some water that's mixed, mixed with some Celtic sea salt so some salt water and then you brush your teeth now the one thing is is that you want to do this first thing in the morning okay you don't want to be doing this like in the middle of the day. You want to do it first thing in the morning before you eat. You have to do it on an empty stomach. Okay, and it's a way of kind of waking yourself up. So make sure to have 15 to 20 minutes where you can be just swishing, not talking. And the one thing you want to make sure not to do is swallow this stuff. Okay, so I'm going to demonstrate how to do it. Now, the first thing you want to do before you actually put the oil in your mouth is you want to get the salt water ready. Okay, so you just get a glass of spring water and you fill it up and then you just take like a pinch of salt Celtic sea salt or Himalayan salt not the not the the um, not table salt not the iodized salt okay put it in the water it's gonna go to the bottom and it's gonna start to dissolve okay and then you're gonna put that aside and then you're gonna grab your coconut oil okay which I'm using today and a spoon and you're going to take a little bit out. See how much I've got? It's not that much. It's like probably less than less than a teaspoon. Okay. And I'm going to put it in my mouth and I'm not going to be able to talk. So you have to just see what I'm doing. But pretty much what I'm doing is I'm swishing this stuff in my mouth and it's going to liquefy. Okay. At first it's going to be solid, but it's going to melt in my mouth. I'm swishing around. I am not swallowing it. And I'm going to be doing this for 15 to 20 minutes. So I'm going to show you how it starts off and then I'll show you what I do afterwards. Okay? So So you're going to swish everything around for 15 to 20 minutes, okay? On an empty stomach. And then when you're ready, you're going to spit it out in the toilet, okay? And then once you're done, you're gonna go and then get your salt water, so your water that had a little bit of salt in it, and you're gonna take a few sips. So you're gonna rinse out your mouth with the salt water like you just saw, and you're gonna do that a few times. Do it until there's no water left in the glass, okay? So you just keep taking you know, a few sips of it, swish it around your mouth, spit it out back in the toilet, and do it again and again until it's out. And then after that, then you can brush your teeth, okay? Now, I suggest everyone to try this out because I, I did this when I first started, when I first went raw two years ago, I, I mentioned this in previous videos that I had problems with some of my gums, that I was having receding gums and dentists wanted to graft it the whole bit, okay? And this was one of the things that I did every day, every morning, you know, first thing in the morning before I did anything. I just swish around the oil in my mouth, rinse out with salt water, brush my teeth and it really helped my gums and I noticed whenever I do have any kind of 
pro like if I have any irritation in my mouth or any kind of feeling like my, my gums are getting funny, whatever, I always go back to oil pulling. I also notice too, especially with drinking a lot of green juices like I drink, you know, my, my teeth do get a little bit discolored from the green juices, from the chlorophyll, the green in it. And so this also really helps to keep my teeth bright and fresh. And I just noticed too that, especially with the coconut oil, it's very therapeutic on the gums, you'll, you'll see. And it's also antibacterial. And our mouth is like the one area of our body that is just full of toxins and microbes and bacteria. So it's one thing you want to keep it clean. And this will help to have, you know, clean, fresh breath, sparkling white teeth, and healthy gums, that, that's most important. Okay, so do try it out. You might not notice a, a difference overnight, but if you do this every day for a few weeks on end, you will start t noticing a difference. Even take a photograph of your teeth and notice the, the change of color, okay? It's exciting. So something for you to try, easy, fun, and you're doing yourself a favor. So I'm wishing you guys the most fabulous, fabulous day, and I'll see you tomorrow, bye.